If you lived here, this could be you. I know what you're thinking. Here he goes again, hanging out in his client's bathtub. Watch the video and you'll see what I'm talking about. Hi everyone and welcome to my newest listing located at 14 Forest Lane in Hopkinton, Massachusetts. This townhome style condominium has about 2368 square feet of living space which includes about 640 square feet in the finished basement. It's located in a beautiful development called the Preserves of Hopkinton. And look at all the woods you have surrounding this gorgeous development. And best of all, it's only minutes from highway access and the commuter train and right across the street is actually the, um, the Hopkins State Park located right over there which has boating, swimming, hiking trails, literally right across the street from the entrance of this development. All right, let's head on in and take a look. All right, we're gonna start the tour in the two-story foyer. It's already a good start. Let me just head down here and back up so you can see that. Look at all the light that you have coming in from those windows. All right, let's start the tour. Um, so this property has two bedrooms, two and a half baths, and whoa, and an awesome kitchen. Looks like we have quartz countertops, a huge island that everybody likes. We have stainless steel appliances. We have a beverage or wine fridge right there. Let's back up so we can give you a good tour of this kitchen. The cabinets are in excellent condition. And by the way, the floors, gleaming hardwood floors. That's a nice shot so you can see how it opens to the family room and the dining area. Here, let me head down here. This is the, um, the living room. We have a fireplace right there, windows that overlook the deck, which we'll go see in a few. There's a nice shot right there. That's probably my favorite because you can see how the kitchen flows to the dining room and of course to the living room. Let's go ahead into the dining room, which has a nice built-in and I like the, uh, the, the, the brick wall right here that looks nice too. And by the way, that is real brick. There's another nice shot so you can see the flow. Nice built in. Now we'll back into the kitchen just so you can get an idea of if you lived here, what you would be seeing right now. I like how the microwave's in the island, that's nice. And by the way, this island, uh, the countertop does overlap, so you can see it fits three bar stools easily. And I love this living space. We've got nice crown molding up on the walls. Um, you know what, while we're here, let's show you the backyard. I like how you have this little um, privacy wall right there. Look at that. Just looking at nature. How nice is that? Beautiful. All right, let's head back in. But I want you to see the decks. There's plenty of room to put like an outdoor table here. You could have your grill out here. All right, let's head back in. Okay, so I think we are done with the awesome living room, the amazing kitchen with the big center island, and the dining room. Let's see what else we got here. Uh, by the way, this is a big pantry, which you're going to like, so come on in and check it out. Uh, to the left here, we have the um, first floor half bathroom, hardwood floors, granite counters over there. Um, we do have a one-car attached garage through here, so wicked convenient. You 
you know, park your car in there and boom, you come right into your house. All right, let's see. So over here we have two closets. We have the finished basement, which we'll go see in a few minutes, but first we're gonna head on upstairs. There's that big window that I love. Nice view. There's a shot of where we came in. There's the front door. Again, garage door over there. Nice hardwood floors and stairs. Still more hardwood. Okay, so let's see. Let's start with the main bedroom, which is down the hall. We do have a pull down attic here. Okay, so here is the main bedroom, which is pretty big. That is a king size bed, and look how much space you have. I'm actually gonna head over here so you can see that there is a skylight up there. Um, and this is a good shot right here so you can see how big this room is. There's the door we came in. We're gonna be heading to the bathroom in a minute to show you the main bathroom, which actually has a barn door over there. Um, and you can see all neutral paint throughout the walls. I mean, throughout the condo on all the walls. Here's another shot of the bed, and there's the um, high ceilings right here. Double closets for uh, all your clothes. And then I like this little sitting area over there. The, the current owner uses this space as a, um, as a little office, little sitting area. All right, let's, um, let's head into the bathroom. So I just want to show you that there is a um, barn door style door. Very cool. And wait till you see this bathroom. For once I thought I'd stop talking, just so you can see how nice this bathroom is. I love how it has the high ceilings here. And then check out the, um, the shower. You have a seat over there. It's big. And it's nice. Uh, and then behind us, of course, you already saw the standalone soaking tub. I like how it has the not only the faucet, but you have your little shower wand there. Um, and I'm pretty sure you already saw the double sinks, double vanity. Now I'm gonna back out so you can see how that this, this soaking tub is like the focal point. I like how it has the high ceilings. I like the natural wood. I'm just gonna walk backwards so you can take another look at this beautiful bathroom. Okay, all right, let's head on down to bedroom number two and the, um, the next full bath. Now what's really cool, if you notice, we have a door from the hallway to the full bath and laundry, but we also, which I really like this feature, is the second bedroom or the guest bedroom um, has also has access to the bathroom. So you could lock the door from the hallway and this becomes the private bathroom for the person who's in this bedroom. But, but check out the size of it. This is a really good sized bedroom. Nice big window with views of the outside. Double closet over there. Again, it has the high ceilings right here. And let's head into the bathroom. So in here we have, looks like we have a solid counter here. Good size vanity. There's your uh, tub with shower doors. And then of course, linen closet over here. Uh, sorry that you have to see me in the mirror there. Tried to avoid that. Um, here is laundry. So you have second floor laundry in this home. All right, so let's make sure that we got everything upstairs. We got main bedroom, second bedroom, full bath here, and we saw the main bath, so let's head down to the basement.
Okay, here we are in the finished basement, and it really is a great size. There's about 640 square feet of finished space down here. Let me just stand over in this corner so you can see how big it is. Uh, behind this door right here, you have storage. That's where your HVAC, you know, your heating and AC system is, and of course the hot water heater. That's a good shot too, so you can see how large it is. Plenty of room for a big TV. You can put a big sectional in here, more furniture if you want. Plenty of room for a workout room or just a playroom for the kids or adults. Uh, that right there is a door to the bulkhead, which leads to the backyard. Okay, we have another storage room there and another closet right there. So that is it. Okay, well thank you for joining me on this tour. Um, I'm just gonna give you one more very quick shot of the kitchen, living room, dining room, big island, and now we'll head out the front door. And check out these the beautiful grounds here. They do such a good job landscaping. All right, well, thank you for joining me on this tour and hopefully you'll come and check out 14 Forest Lane. Mm -hmm.